Andy Woodman, thanks for joining us once again. Let's take a look back then at Saturday's match against Solihull. A 2-1 victory on the day and actually some of the goal line <coughs> clearances is probably just as important as the goals, weren't they? Absolutely, yeah. I thought we defended really well, made some uh, important clearances at important times. Um, but that said, I, I still stand by that we probably should have been just probably a couple more goals in front at half-time. Um, but they're a good team. Look, you know, we've got to pay respect to these teams. They're decent teams. Um, but I thought we'd done a really good job of them. I thought we were very professional, working like what we tried to do. Uh, we worked all week on a certain way of how we were going to try and win the game. And pleasing for me, that it, you know, it come off the way it did. And we've already talked about Scott Wagstaff and his debut. Another one making their league debut was Palace Francis, brought one in the second half. What were your thoughts on this? Yeah, Palace, yeah, he got his first sort of run out, really. Um, <clears throat> he had a moment, really, where he, in training all week, that moment's presented itself to him in training and he's, he's ripped it up and gone and smashed it in the top corner. I think he was probably just trying to play for the team probably a little bit too much on that moment when he, when he had the ball. Um, but, he, you know, it's just good to get him, you know, into the, into the, the team and get him some minutes. He's still a young boy. So he, he'll be OK. He'll be one that's dipped in and dipped out like most of the youngsters and hopefully as we go forward he'll, he'll feature more and score some more goals for us. And of course, Monday was back to training. How's everyone done this week? Yeah, it's been a really good week. We've, we've worked very hard. Um, we, we know how important this Aldershot game is. Um, so, yeah, we're looking forward to the game at Aldershot. We know it's going to be a tough game. Um, uh, the manager there has got them playing some you know, pretty solid, stellar football. Um, and we, we, yeah, we know what to expect going there. But uh, we, we want to sort of continue our run in this competition. And when you say we know what to expect, it was just a couple of months ago that actually we were down at Aldershot. And it, a, a tough game on that day, an entertaining one for the fans. I'm not sure you would have seen it that way. Yeah, I, I don't. I mean, I've had a couple of games at Aldershot, and I think they've both been free too. So I'd quite like a 1 0 if possible, or a 2 0 to us. Um, I, I think it's one of those places, it's always going to be, uh, you could probably argue it's a bit of a derby match in a weird way. Um, so yeah, it'd be tough. Um, I'm look, looking forward to seeing their manager. He's, he's a very nice man, and his team are playing well. And hopefully, uh, you know, we can come out triumph on the day. After that, it's away to Grimsby, but then two really big home games to, to finish off the month. And I guess for all of the games now, as we always say, the support's going to be so important, isn't it? To yeah, the support's line. going to be massive, and I think they're quite nice games. Uh, my phone's been buzzing um, with people trying to get tickets for those home games, so so that's always quite nice because it means we've got you know a, a good little time coming up. But yeah, it, they're, they're going to be tough. Uh, we could say that Stockport's going to be tough, Grimsby's going to be tough. Look, they're all going to be tough. Uh, we found that at Maidenhead. <clears throat> so um, we'll be approaching every game as we've done the first half of the season, and uh, you know trying to keep ourselves in the in the pack. And they're just everyone says it, but there are no easy games in this league, are there? No, 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 no. I wish there was. <laughs> <laughs> make my make my Saturdays a lot more enjoyable. <laughs> um, but yeah, we, we've just got to keep concentrating on what we do, and then we we know where what what we've got to do, what target we've got to hit, uh, and, and we're on course. So uh, yeah, we just got to keep churning out the results.